name is Ashley Marina. I'm 12 years old and I'm from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania and I'll be singing. Hey guys, I'm Mohammad Chazib. I'm from Islamabad, Pakistan and I'll be commentating on this video. I do a lot of school talent shows and just, yeah. Neither one of us sing. No. Neither one of us come from a music background. <laughs> well then, maybe she's adopted, right? Because neither of you sing. Neither of you know how to spell a piano. So surely the daughter ain't yours, you know? We're extremely proud of her, her work ethic because I think that's the key to her success. Let's do some vocal warm-ups, okay? I love to sing with my best friend. Her name is Coco. Coco, your turn. <laughs> yes, ladies and gentlemen. We went from Minions all the way to, I don't know, Shaun the Sheep or something. Like, what animated character is coming next? Like, Joseph Joestar or something? You like that lettuce? She can hit those whistle tones like Mariah Carey. Are you nervous? <laughs> a little bit? Okay. She's up right now. Yeah. I had a dream last night, and my dream was that I was backstage from America's Got Talent, and Terry was like, come on, you got this. And he went, and he pushed me, and I went on stage, and I was like, so excited, and then I woke up. <laughs> it's your time. Go right ahead, and you can follow me too. I'm really excited to like actually like see myself all like on the show. Like, <laughs> hello. Hi. How are you? Jesus, Simon, just close those buttons, bro. Like, this little girl might just get nightmares. Like, who knows? Good. Lovely to meet you. What's your name? I'm Ashley Marina. And where are you from? I'm from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Ooh, that's where my husband is from. Is that right? <laughs> um, and do you have any pets? Right. Nice question, Simon. Like, yeah, what's your name? Where are you from? Do you have any pets? Like, what's next? Do you have a Ugandan visa or something? Like, come on, Simon. Stick to the script, man. Like. What kind of questions are these? I have a pet guinea pig. Her name is Coco. I <laughs> love guinea pigs. I love guinea pigs too. They are the cutest little things. I love to dress up my guinea pig in dresses. Like, it's the best. <laughs> oh, I didn't do that. <laughs> Would she be the first person you call if you got a yes? Definitely. Okay. I called her before the show. And what did she say? She just looked at me and ate her vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> and so you're a singer? Yep. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. Here we go. Oh my God, I'm scared. You can chase a dream that seems so out of reach, and you know it might not ever come your way. Um, do you have a second song? Yes. Okay, that backing track was very overbearing. That backing track was very overbearing. Like, this guy doesn't even know what he's talking about. Like, he's like, Oh, the optical bearing of the 90 degree angle of the curvature of the latitude of the song. Like, what does this guy want? Like, he, 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 like I get it. He wants to focus on her voice more than, you know, the beat or whatever, but... She, she's she's literally roaring in this uh, in this theater like a head ass Lion King. I don't know. She she's really loud. Like how can't you hear her? Um, so can we try the second song a cappella so we get to hear your voice a yeah. little bit more clearly? Because I think you've got a good voice. It's a good song, but not right for you the first one. Okay.
Under the glow of the very bright lights I turn my face towards the warm night sky And I am not afraid of a thousand eyes Okay, uh, Ash, you want my honest opinion? I think you bought the wrong songs with you today. I mean, do I really have to say anything here? Like, the audience is genuinely just saying it for me. It's very difficult for me, I don't know about the others, to actually judge you on that. I, I, I just wouldn't know where to go right now. Like, this Gordon Ramsay knockoff really doesn't care about his fans or the audience or what they think, you know, because... This guy is living in an imaginary world where he has no ears when it comes to listening to other people's opinions and in this case the audiences because like he doesn't even really care about anyone really. Can, can we give her another chance? Because you've done that, you have given them like some time to change the song yeah. or to come back. Yeah. Why don't we do that with okay. her? Yes, come on back. Okay, okay. Okay. Um, I think uh, Sophia's right. If you wouldn't mind coming back this afternoon and just try out in the time you've got the couple new ideas, my suggestion is maybe do your version of a guy's song rather than what you're doing at the moment, which is a bit karaoke. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. So we'll see you later. Good okay, luck! Bye. Thank you. Right, can I just say that this girl is already winning the show or whatever, this this whole audition because basically she has a positive attitude. She came in talking about her guinea pig and how it can talk and she actually has a great voice so everyone already loves her and except for Walmart Gordon Ramsay but I'm guessing she will impress that guy soon as well. Like, that's the problem with, like, half of the contestants on the show. Like, they generally, they just come on the stage with, like, a horrible attitude, like, horrible personality. And no one in the crowd likes them. And they straight up get cancelled by the judges. So, like, I'm, uh, like, I'm just saying that if you win the crowd's, you know, love in the beginning, like, that's the key to success. Back, back. You're going to go downstairs. If you get the right song, you can knock it out of the park. I, I believe in you. I'm happy that they gave me a second chance. It's all about your performance, all about the song. But I'm like, I'm like, whew. Do you want to try a Shawn Mendes song? Sure. We're going to play it for you, see if you like it. It's kind of hard because we're supposed to find a song that was written or sang by a boy. The, lyric, the lyrics aren't really appropriate. What's the name of the second one? Do you know the song? I don't really know the lyrics. What other boys' songs do you know? So someone younger, someone male. Oh yeah, we can just plug you in. Some of the, the younger kids we've seen this year, some of the singers, just unbelievable. Yeah. But at the same time, like you did with this girl, if you're not getting it then, yeah. give it a second chance if you can. Because you never know. You have, you have to feel comfortable with the song. Lyrics are hard for me. It's your choice, you know? If you're not feeling it, just tell us. We're trying to find a song. I just hope he likes it. We tried some songs and they just weren't like working out. I don't want to regret the song choice, but we don't have enough time. Well, this is your mic, okay? Proud of you, honey. Love you. Everybody wants to see what else you have. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, go out there and make it happen, Ashley. Family, you can come with me. Again? Yep. You're back. Hello, Ashley. And what's the song you've, you've chosen? We tried out a couple songs and I was just not like getting into them. Okay. So, I'm actually doing an original song. I know I can get into this because I wrote it. Because you so. wrote it. And what's the song about? It's about my dad. And yeah. It's about how he's always been there for me. And is he here today? Yep, he's backstage. Hi, Dad.
let's hope this works out guys this is genuinely amazing because not only did she write this song but it's also about her dad i mean like she could have chosen any boy song in the world like there's gooba or fifi or bb or kiki or kuda or the all-time hit stupid featuring six nines best mate bobby fisher oh no that's the wrong bobby bobby what was it shmurda or something but no she goes with an original song and yeah this is truly amazing like who could resist using a 6 9 song for an audition on America's Got Talent like seriously who's always there when i need you saving every day comes to my rescue whenever i'm a friend who's the one that truly loves me like no Damn, sorry guys, I actually couldn't help but shed some tears myself. Like, I mean, genuinely, like this was really amazing. And I have seen a lot of auditions, but this one is just like, this is it, you know? I mean, she sang three times. Like, no one does that on any audition you would ever see. I mean, maybe some. And I swear to God, if Gordon Ramsay said sing again or something like that, I swear, bro. I, I'm flying out to wherever he lives, like London or wherever. I'm I'm flying out to the cave he's hiding in and I'm going to smash a lamb sauce on his head because like, I'm just not taking this. Like he already made her like sing three times when once was enough because her voice is amazing, you know? I mean, big up Ashley. Like someone give this minion a banana or something because like that performance was like amazing but yeah guys that's it for today's video uh hopefully you guys enjoyed this video obviously nothing said in this video is actually serious it was all for jokes and all of that so hope you guys do not get too offended or anything like that don't forget to drop a sub and i don't know comment like whatever peace i'm out